Hello, this is Miranda Dushak with Lincoln University Cooperative Extension. I'm here at Red Fox Farm in Spanish Lake, Missouri with the owner farmer, Chris Oligas. He's uh, holding, the, holding the video recording equipment right now. And we're gonna talk about planting strawberries. Strawberries are a great plant to grow in Missouri. They're relatively easy. It's suited well for this climate. So I always like to encourage anyone who can to grow some strawberries. They can grow in pots or in the ground. Here we're putting them in the ground at Red Fox Farm. We're using bare root plants, which I ordered from a seed company. So I didn't start these from seed. I've never tried that. I've heard it's sort of tricky and my strawberry growing friends and in my strawberry growing experience, I've always done bare root plants. So they came in this way. This is a day neutral variety. And that means that uh, it should be sh uh, producing berries, harvestable berries all, all year long. So through from late spring into summer, the berries will get smaller during the heat of the summer, but then in fall, they should uh, be a larger size again and we could harvest into uh, early fall. So this is great. The day neutral variety is great for a family or the market gardener. What we did here was we prepped the garden bed using the shovel and the fork to create a, t a trench. When you plant bare root strawberries, you want the roots totally facing down. You don't want to plant them uh, with the roots lying on the side. You want them to plant, plant down. So I, I did pretty far here, um, went down pretty far and we plant them 18 inches apart in a row. They will have runners. Um, they'll shoot off uh, babies, uh, daughter plants, which will prune kind of this first year. Um, but then the strawberries should last one to two full seasons for the day neutral varieties, usually three to four for a, a more heirloom variety or just a, a June bearing variety. But so what we're gonna do, like Chris talked earlier, about uh, when we were planting our seedlings, our collard seedlings, also with our strawberry seedlings, we wanna make sure that the soil covers up to the, covers the, the crown of the plant, right? You wanna have all those roots down. You don't want any roots up because it could dry out and you wanna cover it, but yet still have this little um, plant material uh, coming right out of the top. So again, you have to go far, pretty far down with these. You can wrap them around the edge of a stake and push them into the ground, the root hairs, if you don't get uh, your trench deep enough. But I did, and I'm gonna break up soil, put it around, and like Chris said, use my hands to push it down, covering the roots. And then these we will water in and irrigate throughout the summer. So that's our little informational video about growing strawberries, enjoy.